In order to improve our current business canvas model, the Pinecone interviewed individuals in the Waterloo region who will represent our potential customer segment. Before conducting interviews, our team made several predictions forecasting what the participants' answers may be. We started off with predicting that the food prices rising over the years will put an additional burden on the budget, so people will consider growing it by themselves. Second, a lot of people will have minimal or no knowledge about hydroponics. Third, we thought that the younger generation, the millennials, would be more mindful about what they eat. And lastly, we thought that people would prefer organic products over non-organic produce found in most grocery stores. We also deemed the list of pains found within a modern society and the gains associated with our product that will benefit these customers. A major pain is the increasing cost of produce. This causes a significant strain on income, especially when it comes to fruits and vegetables, as they are a main item found on the grocery list. However, due to the pine cone's ability to grow produce throughout any season, consumers can save money in the long run, as they will have an access to freshly grown produce at a lower cost. Additionally, our product minimizes the pain of lack of space and tedious maintenance that is associated with gardening. As a game, and eaten, well, the pine cone doesn't take up as much space compared to a modern garden and it involves minimal maintenance to grow plants, eliminating any weeds that are usually found in the soil. In addition, the product can be used indoors and outdoors in any living situation. I wonder about hydroponically to the consumer, um, like what I would be wondering about as a mm -hmm. consumer uh -huh. is if it, if it, when it's grown hydroponically, is it getting all the nutrients, like the micronutrients that yeah. it's getting from soil and manure and and um, organics, right? Mm -hmm. If I had the space, yeah, it would be, I guess, something to try. Okay. And um, again, it all depends on how much it takes to run it Okay. when it comes to heat and okay. hydro. No, I haven't heard about it. If it's proven safe, then I would probably do it. I don't go organic. Um, I just make sure when I choose my vegetables, I always check that they are fresh. Um, the certification of organic mm -hmm. is not a guarantee that the product is organic. Mm -hmm. It's not a guarantee that there's no pesticides. Mm -hmm. It's not a guarantee that there's no chemicals. Mm -hmm. And it's not a guarantee that it's necessarily healthier for you. It's all crap. It's all crap. Why? It's all crap. Canadian organic standards are not the same as European organic standards. Okay. Europe, you have to be a, a ten year free of pesticides in the land. Okay. Here, it's just one year. I find organic doesn't look as good, or I don't feel I need to pay that extra cost. It it has to be fresh, and sometimes the organic doesn't look as fresh. Our main goal behind constructing these interviews was to obtain valuable information indicating what our customers are searching for in their day-to-day -day lives. After asking a wide range of age demographics, we have received results that contradict with our early predictions like most of the participants were against brand organic, most of them were for natural. There's a lack of awareness among most of the population regarding hydroponics and lack of knowledge about healthy ways of living. And also, gardening is not deemed to be of a great importance in terms of saving money on produce, yet it's not that popular. Overall, more time is needed for paradigm shift to happen. So as a result of these implications, our team decided to implement a few changes and approaches in order to fit our potential customer desires. For instance, as a marketing strategy, the pine cone should move away from millennials and baby boomers to therefore target the middle-aged demographic and people interested in healthier nutrition. Another approach considered to obtain a larger customer segment is providing a variety of sizes in terms of our product. This will give the customer the option to choose which size of product they would prefer over the other. In regards of information and as a benefit to us, by researching the amount of people who already own a hydroponic plant system and reading their reviews, that could ultimately help us gain insight of how our product can be further improved.